Hi guys, today I'm going to teach you how to operate your air conditioners through Bluetooth in four simple steps. Step 1. Activate the remote controller Bluetooth. Step 2. Get the Bluetooth address from the remote controller. Step 3 and 4. Download the Mitsubishi Electric, Melrimo Pro and Melrimo apps. If you have more than one remote controller, do these four steps individually for each remote controller. Before you start, look at the remote controller name located here at the bottom. The Bluetooth available only for suffix SB and PB. You can press here for more information. If you get value from this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. So, step number one, activate the remote controller Bluetooth. The Bluetooth is set by default to off. When the Bluetooth is set to on, you will see this sign on the screen. To activate the Bluetooth, press here on the setting button to bring the main menu. Go to the initial setting menu and press select change the password to zero and press select stay here on basic settings and press select go to bluetooth and press select stay here on bluetooth and change it to on move down to the pin code the pin code is needed to connect your smartphone to the remote controller I recommend you to change it to a number that you can remember such as 0000, so you don't have to remember it by heart. So now let's change it to four zeros and here zero. When you finish, press select and go back a few times to the main menu. Step number two, get the Bluetooth address. You can pass this step if you only have one remote controller. Before you start this step, you need to prepare a note and a pen in advance. Move the cursor to the operation menu and press select. Move here to Bluetooth connection and press select. Here you can see the Bluetooth address write down the last four digits of the Bluetooth address without the hyphen in a chart. For example, if the remote controller connected to the living room AC unit, then write living room 6EE8. -E when you finish, go back to the main menu and here you can see that the Bluetooth is activated. Now we will continue to step number three. Download the gray Melrimo Pro app. This app will allow us to change the default model name of the remote controller from something that looks like this or this to more friendly name like this or this. So open your browser and type Melrimo Pro app go now this is the gray app click install click open while using the app allow allow scroll down to the bottom click agree now go to settings plus create new this is my remote controller press ok initial setting device name click here press living room living here space room R O O M. When you finish, click OK. So go to go back, back 
and done. You have now to save the settings that you have entered. This is a random name. I call it one. Okay. Now go to one, press on it, click send data to remote controller. Now you see the Bluetooth address of the remote controller that we have write down and step number two, click here now click here the password is zero 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 press send it will ask you for a confirmation P press ok 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 now the name of your remote controller is changed to living room press back back and stay on settings if you have another remote controller, repeat step one, two, and go to step three to the setting and change the default name of the second remote controller and so on. When you finish, close the app and go to step number four. Download the Blue Mail Remote app. Open the web browser or Google Play and type Mail Remote. See that the icon is blue and click install. Click open. While using the app, allow, allow, scroll to the bottom. Click agree. Now you can see the name of the remote controller, the living room. Click on it. Now we need to put a password. The password is the pin code of the remote controller. Since we change it to 0000, we click hit and click send. Okay, now we pair the remote controller with our smartphone. Here is how it looks like. Turn on the air conditioner here. We can change the temperature. We can change the mode here from cooling to heating or dry or fan. Back to cooling. You can turn it off. That's all for today. Thank you very much. Have a nice day and see you soon.